Hello folks, welcome to my new video. Today with my Finding Dory, Finding Nemo collection. Uh, I have here a um, Finding Dory lenticular full slip from Kimchi DVD and a one click box from Blue Fans and uh, a Finding Nemo still book from Germany. Uh, if you like what I'm doing, please consider subscribing to my channel. It would help a lot and activate the notification to not miss any new content. So, let's go. This is one of those shoebox-like uh, one-click boxes um, from Blue Fans. I have several Blue Fans one-clicks, um, but um, only one in this form. Um, Big Hero 6. Uh, Blue Fans all also often uh, offers this shoebox like uh, shoe boxes <laughs> uh, additionally to their normal one click boxes. So, at first, uh, the box itself with this partial gloss. So, those uh, water artwork. So here's what's inside. Uh, as usual, some uh, yeah, some extra stuff with this paper thing that I didn't mention originally. It was in this paper thing, but I didn't mention to get it back. So it's now separate. Uh, and here are the three uh, Blue Fans editions. The Hank, uh, all with their own stickers. Uh, the non lenty uh, single lenty and double lenty. And I will show them one by one. So here it is with uh, Blue Fans exclusive still book. I'm looking really looking forward to see how it how it works because it's yeah uh, it's like a mixture of cardboard and the back side. Really creative. So here are all the four slips and what's uh, inside. I will begin with this extra stuff from the Blue Fans uh, one click. Yeah, here's this thingy kind of mixture of collection of cards or poster. It's really difficult to define it. So you can it's like this fold out thingy, then shows a continuous picture under the sea. And here are the back sides, and the back sides are uh, different characters from Finding Dory. Yeah, and here's Nemo and his dad, and here's Dory. Here you can see how big, how huge this thing is. So now I begin um, one by one. At first, uh, this full slip, this double lenty, and this one is a real beauty with hang changing colors. Uh, it's simply amazing. And by the way, it's not simply a lenticular; it's it's also embossed. Ah, this thing is simply a beauty. Look at this embossing. Yeah. Here is the other side. Finding Dory. Yeah, the other side, and um, as I showed you before, yeah, here was the stick. Uh, well, at first, this thing. And uh, on each one of them is this thingy. And in other Blue Fence editions, it's only a cardboard. But in this case, it's more than that. It's some. It's uh, this f uh, fold out kind of thing. So at first, the sticker with Dory. Really nice sticker. Really creative. Yeah. Uh, um. It's yeah. It's really hard paper. And here's this fold out thing. Yeah. 
Ta-da! And here's this um, card in there with Nemo and Dory. 38 uh, Blue Fans exclusive edition. Exclusive, as far as I know, it means that the still book is, exclu- is Blue Fans exclusive. And OAB only at Blue Fans means that the still book is not exclusive, as far as I understand it. By, But I may be indeed wrong. So. Very, very beautiful. Uh, so here, are the, yeah, all right. Yeah, the same. Okay, they are the same. So now, uh, still book uh, and booklet, uh, and um, as usual, I will I will show all the still books at the end of the video. Uh, yeah, blue fans editions have their still books, and as far as I know, uh, um, uh, um, Kim to DVD edition also has its. Uh, exclusive still book. In contrast, uh, in contrast to uh, other publishers like Kimchi DVD, uh, all, where all the full slips are the same, in this case, all the full slips have different content. Uh, not that uh, much content, but different. Um, and uh, this edition has a 44-page art booklet. As far as I see it, only with pictures, but with extremely beautiful pictures. And other editions have only cards. Other Blue Fence edition. Whereas Kimchi DVD edition has cards and booklet. Ah, didn't. Oh, it's long ago as I watched. Finding Dory, and even longer since I watched the Finding Nemo movie. Yeah, well, not the best, but one of the better uh, Pixar movies. Really looking forward to see what they do with Inside Out. Hopefully, not uh, on par with the first one. And here's Hank with Dory. Now to the Hank edi- so- so-called Hank edition. This one is non-lenty, but with this embossing. Here's the sticker that was on the box. And yeah, here was this uh, thingy, Fallout. I said before, all of them are completely different. Yeah, and this is this Fallout is a Hank Fallout. And here is this Hank card. Really nice idea. So creative. It's exclusive. Very nice. Finding Dory. So, and this one has a full um, an envelope with cards. There should be six of them. The back side. That's really beautiful. Oh, little Dory. Dude, <laughs> the chilled. 
turtles. No single lady. Uh, yeah. Just amazing. Yeah, well. <laughs> Not the best backside. So, here is the sticker. And here is this fold out again. Another fold out. Yeah, that's another fold out, but uh, this, um, yeah, wings, I don't know how I could call them, are the same, actually. Yeah. But uh, what's inside is different. So it was from the first one. And here it is, ta-da! With Dory. And here's this card. With Dory and his, uh, with Dory, with Nemo and his dad. Really beautifully made by this violet. Every card has a different color. Yeah. Finding Dory. So, and now the content of this uh, single lanty full slip is. Um, envelope and here is uh, also six cards this time vertical cards but also extremely beautiful some scenes from underwater Very nice. So now to finding Dory, uh, Kimchi DVD edition, and this there are plenty of those cheap um, Kimchi DVD editions with only a slip cover and a still book and three cards or something. This is not one of them. It's it's one of the of the of the really good editions. Uh, without an exclusive steelbook, with international steelbook, but nevertheless, really, really nice. That's a lenticular version. As you know, if you watch my videos, uh, you know that I always prefer lenticulars. Yeah, it's controversial. There are some people who prefer non-lenticulars. Yeah, and this is this is really beautiful, made with this uh, rainbow effect. And uh, the embossing, and this is well, I bought it uh, used, and um, yeah, I don't know why why they why they play sticker on some on still books on. You can simply cut them out, like you know, cut them out simply with p piece of plastic, and that's all. And you can keep them in the box. I don't know why it's so difficult. So. And as I said before, I don't intend to buy other uh, versions of full slips. I suppose there should be three of them, um, because the content uh, uh, is the same. And here are all the spines. Really, really nice. See how well they match. Well, some of the hand condition is somewhat different. As I said before, BE, Blue Fans exclusive and not or a b only at blue fans yeah well uh, which depends on whether the still book is exclusive uh, other publishers have this uh, uh, for example hgz has a silver label and gold label and mental lab has mental lab exclusive with a separate lenticular if the still book is exclusive so now let's take a look what's inside uh, the kimchi dvd edition a booklet um, an envelope, the still book, uh, as I said before, international still book, but um, you also get this pet slip. It um, it's uh, provided separately, 
but you really can put uh, the steelbook in pad sleeve inside the full sleeve. It, it, it really works. So, it's really, really nice pad sleeve. And there are also some goodies inside the steelbook. As I said before, the steelbooks themselves, they will show at the end of the video. So, this edition is really jam-packed. Now to the booklet. Yeah, it's a Korean edition and uh, mostly, yeah, mostly the uh, Kimchi DVD has um, in the front Korean text and then in the second half uh, English text. I suppose it's fine. I suppose it's translation, not uh, some different text. Yeah. In contrast to, there are some Korean uh, full slips that actually have completely um some Co korean or chinese uh, they they actually don't have uh, english text at all and uh film runner for example it's a czech company but it tries to evoke to 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 avoid um czech language as far as possible so the it's, everything is in english and the booklets are also completely in english and you Mostly couldn't say that it's a Czech edition. Yo, so, very nice. Yeah, where should it begin? Uh, <laughs> yeah, I begin with, the, with, with this envelope. Yeah, this beautiful envelope uh, has some cards. Again, with the same rainbow effect as the full slip itself. Really, ah, it's just... I don't know if you can really good see it, but um, in reality it, it looks amazing. So here's this nice backside. Yeah, that's not only paper. It's it's it's. They feel like plastic. They feel special. Yeah, very similar artworks as in the Blue Fence edition. So you can really see. Sometimes they use the same artworks. They use them differently, but they use the same. Yeah, we already saw this um, artworks uh, in blue fans but without the rainbow effect yeah. so and here again they really love this rainbow effect um, with this rainbow bubbles and those are kind of cards I don't know how I can I, I can call them because they, they are not uh, they are not, no paper cards it's really plastic um transparent yeah transparent plastic that are stored inside the still book yeah very transparent very very creative And before I forget it, there is also this uh, lenticular sticker, this usual holographic uh, Disney sticker. Yeah, they are mostly added to, to some editions, but you know, I think they are really nice. Yeah, with this uh, Mickey. Uh, yeah, and before I forget it, uh, there there was I also have this uh, um, uh, this kind of limited edition kind of full slip from Germany that's a well usual international release but with German text on it Finde Dory spelled differently it has this MRA and some cards that I won't show you a little bit pale but they are also really nice uh, those are cardboard uh, really thick cardboard cards <clears throat> and as far as I see it, uh, there, those shouldn't be real. I don't know. I think that's not actual scenes from the movie. Those looks like concept artwork. Very, very beautiful concept artwork. Yeah. 
and this German limited edition has a very similar spine to the to the Kimchi DVD one, but with a German text on it. Don't know what why it's called Dory, with E, I E, and not with Y. Okay. So now finally to the still books. Uh, and I also wanted to show you my Finding Nemo still book, that is also from Germany. Here's the J card. And uh, this is an extremely beautiful still book, but for some reason it uses German text. Let me know in the comments below what do you think about it. I mean, I, I uh, in one of my last videos I showed you Hunger Games, Ballad of Songbirds, the Snakes. It was a French still book and it had also French text on it. What do you think? It's is it uh, reasonable to place um yeah, translated uh, so the 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 local title well, for me at least I I I only I like um international titles more, but well, it's just me. Okay. Now, uh where should I begin? Well, I begin at first with this pet slip uh, from Finding Dory, that's Kimchi DVD exclusive, and it adds um, adds title and so uh, title and spine title to the still book, to the international Finding Dory still book, because the still book itself doesn't have any title and anything on the spine, which was. Um, yeah, which is, well, the, the complete opposite to most still books where you have too much text, you have too little text, it was heavily criticized, so I, sup uh, I suppose, uh, so there were those, those Disney still books where they put just uh, all those um, heads, faces from, from the movie, um, well, I think they, uh, Disney doesn't do it anymore in that way. Mostly they have some text on their still books, but well, uh, I think it's still uh, not bad. Uh, there are one one with this. Um, uh, you can do it much much worse. For example, with ugly still book that has too much text on it. I think it's better to have less text than than too much text. But well, it's just me. So it doesn't bother me that much. It's Nonsensical, but that doesn't bother me that much. So now, Finding Nemo still book, Findet Nemo in German, with this uh, shark and this incredibly beautiful embossing, debossing. Yeah, here again, the German title. Yeah, it's a very very nice still book. Now to the Finding Dory International Stillbook without the pet slip. Just Disney Pixar. Yeah. Very nice artwork indeed, yeah. Well, uh, at least much better than, than what Warner did at the time. with Like with Deadpool 2 or Ready Player 1. Stillbooks. Yeah, here finding Dory. This is um, Blue Fans exclusive, and most of them are incredible. Most of them are incredible. Blue Fans mostly uses embossing, debossing, and yeah, all still books are the same in all the full in all the Blue Fans uh, full slips. Yeah, yeah, this is actually nearly the same backside, nearly the same. Here you see Dory, here you don't. Before I forget it, a small spine comparison. I had to switch uh, places because, uh, yeah, well, you can't see anything on the international one. Here is the German one, and here is the blue fence one from China. Yeah. Let's take a look what's inside the still book. Finding Nemo in the 2D and 3D version. Oh, that's just nice inside that book. Uh, now uh, uh, you have to consider 3D, Nemo, uh, Finding Nemo 3D, you have to consider that this movie is from 2003. So by now over 21 years ago. 
uh, and there were no uh, th- um, th- um, uh, this movie wasn't released in 3D in, um, initially. Uh, there was a re-release in 2012. Uh, release in 20, 3D re-release in 2012. Uh, and this version came uh, to Blu-ray. Yeah. Before the 3D hype was unfortunately over, at least uh, on the home market. Which I find very unfortunate because I don't get why why modern modern TVs can't simply have this feature for people who want to watch them. And there are millions of uh, folks. I'm not. The, I know that I'm not the only one who wants to watch uh, 3D movies, and that's simply nonsensical. So, but stop ranting. <laughs> now to finding Dory, uh, still book from um, from Blue Fans. And here you can see how is this is this uh, the Chinese edition, but in contrast to German edition, they don't put the Chinese title on the on the front and keep it. Yeah, so they keep it international. Yeah, I suppose I can't read it, but I suppose it's something like Finding D- Nemo Two. Yeah, da 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 two. And here's this amazing inside artwork. A little bit pale, but nevertheless, very, very beautiful. Blue Fans steelbooks are really amazing. And as usual for Blue Fans, there is nothing inside the steelbooks so or no cards. Yeah. Now to the international steelbook from the Kimchi DVD edition. So, and in this steelbook, there are three discs, 3D version. Yeah, that was initially released, of course, because the movie came out I suppose 2016 or something yeah but takes place uh, merely I suppose very short time after the first one so that's the uh, that's the advantage uh, when you don't have to when you don't have a live action movie where you have to well take the same characters who are aged in the time but an animated ones so uh, the movie in 2D and bonus disc. And here is the artwork inside of this cellbook. Yeah, the advantage of the fat slip that you can put it on the other side as well. <laughs> Doesn't really matter. Ah, and I didn't notice it at first because it's uh, the pet slip is really cleverly made because it's made that way that uh, Dory is inside the jug. Uh, so folks, so folks, that was it. That was my uh, Finding Dory collection uh, with three full slips from um, Blue Fans and uh, one from Kimchi DVD and this beautiful uh, German steelbook. Uh, and I'm really glad that in contrast, to, for example, to to um, Big Hero Six, uh, Six, where you had only two full slips and one uh, and uh, one slip cover. You have really three real complete full slips with all the stuff. So, let me know in the comments below which is your favorite, Finding Nemo or Finding Dory? You can let me know in the comments below which is your favorite Pixar movie and how did you like this, this editions. Till the next time, bye bye!